Today I'm going to show you how to make DIY rib sticks to exercise your shoulders and to do a full 10 minute rib stick workout. I went to the rib stick website, they're charging $67 for one set of rib stick with the rubber bands. I was inspired by the YouTube video made by Mr. Clint Grimes titled DIY Rip Right Ripstick for less than $10, simple, effective, cheap. He basically used two PVC pipes that uh, were about 6 to 7 inches long and bought rubber bands that you could get from any store. I'll show you how I replicated his process. Here is a piece of PVC pipe that I got from Ace Hardware store. Ace Hardware store, at least the one that I went to, only sells full length PVC pipes, which is very, very long. They didn't sell any shorter ones. I looked online, you could get a two feet PVC pipe from Home Depot for about $2. However, how are you gonna cut it into size? From two feet into this, you need a pipe cutter or saw. I like Ace Hardware because there's always a worker asking you when you go in, what are you looking for? Do you need help with anything? I actually found that they cut the pipes for you for free. I just bought their PVC pipe. This one is actually the thinnest, it costs a little over $6. I bought these PVC caps from the same store. These cost me 79 cents each. I bought these rubber bands from Walmart. It cost a little over a dollar, a dollar 12 cents. The rubber bands around each end. Okay. One. As I attempted this workout, I discovered the benefits as well as the limitations of this exercise tool. The benefit is that the deltoids are always contracting when you use this device. It could be as effective as exercises like lateral raising. In a small space where you don't have the room to do lateral raises, or if you don't have the weights to perform lateral raises, this is an effective tool to build deltoid muscles. The limitations is that it doesn't really work on any other muscles as effectively. Muscles such as triceps, pecs, and serratus, and terrier may be active during the use of this device, but they are not the targeted muscles. The maker of this device are marketing this thing as uh, this device is responsible for giving inmates in jail great bodies with no equipment. As you read the sentence, you will immediately recognize the contradiction because this device is equipment. So it's basically contradicting itself. After trying this device, I can tell you that this device can give you great deltoids, but great bodies? It depends on how you see it. Deltoids is one of the muscles that look great on a person. They make a person look much bigger than they are. To achieve a upside down triangle physique, you need big deltoids and big latissimus as well as a slim waistline. Uh, this device is able to help you get bigger deltoids. It will help you get to great physique, but by itself it is unable to give you the overall great physique. Well, I don't know anyone who has been incarcerated uh, to testify to the use of this product in jails. Um, YouTubers like Alexander Bromley explains in his video, how do prison inmates get big, strong, and jacked without barbells and gym equipment? He listed some exercises. These look like mainly uh, body weight exercises such as push-ups, chin-ups, squats, planks, and other exercises such as dips and burpees. You could basically work out all the arms and leg muscles doing these body weight exercises. I will admit that if your workout space were limited to a tiny room, like a gel cell, the best exercises would be push-ups, dips, squats, and also this exercise using the ripstick. Inside the gel cell, the only exercise that you might have trouble doing is chin-ups. 
you will need at least something like a door frame or a door in order to do a chin up inside or near a room. Otherwise, you will have to go out of the jail cell to find something to pull up on. Another thing that is worth mentioning is that the serratus interior aspect of the use of this device. The use of this device due to the form of the body when you perform the exercise actually targets more the deltoid rather than the serratus interior. In order to target the serratus interior more, you will have to spread the hands out farther. In order to do that, you will need a long. In order to do that, you will need longer resistance bands, something like a looped there band or looped resistance band. Looped resistance band will work much more effective than uh, the ripstick for the sake of activating serratus interior rather than the deltoid. But if you just want to get big deltoids, this is good enough. There is still about almost 3 minutes of the ripstick workout. It's kind of boring, so I'm just gonna put up some body weight exercises that is great for building upper and lower body strength. 